Live from a corner of Austin where we still <laughs> call it a Jaguar Jaguar Coupe with a confusing goulash of uh, emotions, it's going to be a great night. Now, are we really talking about this? I mean, are we really talking that O.J. Simpson killed Jeffrey Epstein? Oh because here are your hosts, Brian Brushwood and Justin Robert Go. Breaking hearts, breaking dreams, breaking, breaking stars. Oh, doctor, I'm so glad you're here. I'm I'm the doctor, and I'm, that's my job. Well, I mean, my wife has been on me for months. Yeah, so I'll bet you. She's always like, uh, when you get to get them abs checked. Yeah. Well, uh, 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 I'm here to check your abs. So, come I mean, on over here. I mean, come on over here. Let me get them. I'm, I'm, but, but you know how it is. I'm going to check them one ab at a time. <laughs> okay, well. Upper but, left. Before we Bring do. it on in. Let me before, grab that biscuit. I'm going to finger that do, biscuit. Do, like, uh, I'm going to finger that biscuit <laughs> real quick. You're married. Give me that ab, my friend. I'm going to finger that you're, you're, biscuit. You're, you're, you're married. Oh, right? that's a good biscuit. <laughs> Okay. That's a healthy biscuit. Oh, that's a that's a tight biscuit. <laughs> All right, now I'm going to top right. Oh dear. This is I, 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 can I oh at least explain? Oh my god. Oh my god. Um, oh my god. Hold on. Can hold on. Uh, sorry. I'm sorry. I'm like, sorry. Yeah. Okay. I'm sorry. Hold on. I yes. gotta write this down. Yeah. You're writing down. It's good. It's fine. <laughs> That's weird because before you were very excited. You were calling it a business. I'm sorry. I'm, this is very important that I write this down. <laughs> that it's fine. <laughs> that you're writing down the fourth ad. Okay, now, 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 middle left. Oh, oh well. Oh, that's a good biscuit. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Brian. Yo, what up? Hey, uh, man. What's going? What's popping? It's uh, popping slime. It's, it's it's been a minute. Yeah. Since we started the show, and already I feel like we crushed it. Let's call it. <laughs> so, <laughs> uh, no, I, 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 there's no, a lot. You want to know what's great? Huh? Uh, uh, shout out! Shout night? out to Bryce uh, uh, running our TikTok account. Uh, oh my God! People what? are going nuts. People love nuts. They're, 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 my my daughter has deleted TikTok because she's allergic to nuts. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad. Yeah. That's good. It's healthy for her. It's like a biscuit. <laughs> Give me that biscuit. <laughs> uh, uh, hey, look, guys, uh, uh, go follow us on TikTok because uh, I think for us, who immediately forget everything that happened on the show, yes. there's this TikTok account that just shows us being funny. And I'm like, I'm seeing this for the first time. <laughs> Uh, uh, yeah. Hey, are are we okay with that? G uh, can we just decide that we're okay with that? We don't have a choice. Okay. Yeah. Uh, just consider all of this show the fourth ab. It's exactly. It's the one that gets written down and not spoken and about. And not spoken about. I hope you enjoyed it. Sounds like it's fine. I don't need to know nothing. Psst, 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 psst. Not like the <laughs> other ones. Them all biscuits. Yes. <laughs> Bryce first topic. Our first topic is. <laughs> Paddleboard. I, I I've been very rarely. Yeah. Do you give me loose directions for a story that involves you opening a white claw before you tell it? <laughs> <laughs> but that is the case tonight. So I... I'm gonna let you drive. John Tizo was on the show last week. Okay. He's been in town. He wanted to go paddle boarding. Nice weekend. Biscuits. So we go. He does have a nice biscuit. Yeah. Uh, uh, so uh, uh, we uh, uh, we go paddle boarding. I like it a lot. As it turns out, it's not far from my house. It's a fun thing to do. So as we discussed, you bought a paddle board. Bought a paddle board. Yeah. Wow. And so I go out one day and I inflate my paddle board. Wait, by yourself? Yeah. Okay. Just just because I the point is I'm so close to where I can drop in. That this is now just a thing that I can do. If I've got an hour coming back from here. Cool, casual. Boom. Drop in. Go for an hour. Some come back. We're, we're done. Hit the Wendy's. Others go to Torchies. Some people paddleboard in Lady Bird Lake. Yep. Right? And so I go out and I, I inflate it. And the thing I realize is, hey, you want to know what? It sucks to inflate this fucker. Because yeah. you got to get it to like Technically, 15 Technically, it's the PSI. exact opposite. Sure. 
fuck you. <laughs> remember how? Remember the one? No, row? it's fine. No, okay, that was no. fine. That no, was okay, fine. Okay. It's fine. <laughs> so I get a pump that I can plug into my car, yep. and it'll pump up my my paddleboard because the idea of it being like a little short thing that I pop out and do it saves <laughs> the time and aggravation for me to get this pump. Yeah, man. Okay. So here's the problem. I go to try to pump it the first time, and I realize that, oh, shit, I actually had a visual aid here, but I left it in my car. Man, we've, we've covered all, all the topics. The short little thing that you just want to pump it, and it sucks, but then you got an aid. <laughs> One thing I asked. <laughs> <laughs> One thing I asked. <laughs> so the just, thing... Just so, so <laughs> the problem is, is that the hook to inflate it is a a little thing that you like have to screw into it so mm. it holds in place. Okay. Uh, and like a like like a bicycle style? No, or, okay. no, 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 no. It doesn't screw on. It, right. It's literally like a a a uh, like a silo, like with a little claw a, thing, a, a claw thing that you put in and you turn, and so it's locked in place while it fills air. It's all plastic on plastic? Plastic on plastic. Got it. The problem is, is that the inflatable pump thing, yeah. their little uh, uh, nubbins are fatter, and so you have to hold it in oh, no. instead of just leaving it there like you would with the inflatable pump. Now, sure. Is this a case where you just don't have the right gizmos and now you're committed and you're there in the in the in the moment you need to go through with it or So no, I I I get this. I try to fill it up. I realize I have this problem and so Saturday rolls around. Mm. I've got a pretty free day. The only thing I have to do is hang out with you and Trey and Bryce and everybody later in the evening at this crawfish thing that we're doing. Super chore. So, I'm like, you want to know what? I'm going to go out and I'm going to find at uh, uh, Lowe's or, or Home Depot, a thing that I can connect the original hose to the inflatable pump, and there we go. Everything would be have solved, it, right? Got to have it. They don't. All right, go to the Home Depot. They don't. I'm mm. like, you want to know what? All right, enough fucking around. I'll just hold the goddamn thing in place once, and and Ooh. I'll go. I'll go out and and I'll paddleboard for an hour. I'll come back and then I'll be done. Now. At this point, emotionally, you're convinced that once you get on the water, it'll be fine. It'll be happy, ha happy, ha happy paddleboarding, right? Yeah. Well, and also it's like, hey, I brought a few party favors. I got two beers. I'm not trying to get fucked up, but I got two beers, so I'll be out there at a, at a little while. I'll be done paddling. I'll I'll take a little sip and uh, enjoy the the ambiance of a uh, 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 100 degree day in Lady Bird Lake and it'll be a fun time. One tiny question. Go ahead. How much are you hoping to see a bro court moment? Oh, uh, I I'm, I'm 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 expecting a bro court <laughs> okay, okay. moment. All right, all right, all right. You're really there for the concert. Although I really I'm early I'm too early for bro court. Like like bro court really gets kicked off around five or six o'clock because they've been baking all fucking day Got and it. they've been drinking for longer than that. Uh, so uh, uh, I get there and I realize immediately two things. Number one, holding the fucking pump in while it is a hundred and five degrees is very annoying. I, I do feel like it's important to explain to everybody that. 105 degrees is a funny temperature to say. Yeah, it's in fact, if you wanted to express that it was very, very hot, that might be the most hilarious, yes, barely thing believable say. temperature. Yeah, to say. Yeah, it is the actual temperature. It, yeah. at this moment, it is the exact inverse of how funny it is to say with how funny it is to inflate <laughs> to a feel or while moment. holding. Yeah. Yes, yeah. yeah. So I'm I'm doing this, and the next thing you know, these two dudes w roll up, and they're like, "Like, hey, man, uh, uh, can we use your pump?" And I'm like, like "Yeah, uh, wait probably. a minute. You don't you don't know where it's going." I do, okay, good because right now I suspect that you are the subject of a bro court. I'm, no, these guys are actually really cool. Okay, but good, good. They're good, trying good, to good. use my pump. Good, good, good. I, I'm, I'm, I'm holding the thing in, and then I'm like, hey, you want to know what? This is. It sucks to hold it. Oh, also, I assume that I have now broken my input thing on the paddleboard because now when I pull the, the, the thing I'm jamming in out, 
it immediately deflates as opposed to what it was doing before, which was Slow. holding the air in yeah. after it was being directly pumped. So now it's like, I, I, I'm like trying to adjust a little bit. I, I accidentally remove the pump and pss, half of what I have spent the last 10 minutes doing immediately mm. just rushing out into the atmosphere. Mm. So I'm like, all right, guys, you want to know what? You inflate your inner tubes with my pump and I will use the hand pump to get this fucker done. Because I'm just like, at this point, I know I can get it in the fucking water. I know that it sucks to do it. Fuck it. I'm doing this. Just and get yes, it I done. Have, I have Cheech and Chong next to me. And they are like, hey, man, you sure you don't want a truly? And I'm like, fuck it. Give me the truly. Like, I'm, 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 I'm getting a little heated here because it's really hot. And I'm pumping this thing with my fucking hands now. But I'm getting this son of a bitch in the water. I'm going to have a happy time. I'm going to drink two beers on the fucking water. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, truly the seltzer water. Yes. 105 degrees. Yes. So you're uh, not happy? I'm actively looking to the promised land. Okay. I'm <laughs> like you can see looking. happiness. Happiness I'm... is right there. Oh, it's so close. Hi, it's me. It's Snoop Dogg and his Corona. Yes. <laughs> That's happiness. <laughs> yes. I'm living moss. In my head. Yes. Only five minutes from now. Just over there. So finally, I get this fucker to 15 PSI. Oh. Cap it. Oh. Cheech and Chong are like, hey, we're, we're actually just going down to Barton Springs. If you just want to go and float with us, that'd be fine. Now, uh, uh, Barton Springs, the inside or the outside part? Because there's outside. the... Okay, outside. got it. Yeah, yeah. yeah, the free part. Yeah. Uh, like we're just going down there, and I'm like, you want to know what? I'd appreciate it. You seem like really cool guys, uh, uh, but I'm I'm only going on a quick thing. It's gonna be a quick hour on 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 the lake. Me and, me and fucking I, right I back. Have an appointment with Snoop, and I intend to keep it. He does not fuck with you being late. At that point, Brian. Yeah. Did I realize? Oh no! Paddleboard is a compound word. Oh, oh no! <laughs> You dumb motherfucker. I wish I had only did? paid attention <laughs> to the back half. <laughs> oh, you forgot that it was because work. I, mean, I had left my paddle <laughs> oh, no! in my garage. La uh, real quick, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, we try very hard to uh, 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 play to both the video audience, the live audience. Yes. To those who are listening in the audio sphere, I'm sorry. We're going to abandon all of the audio people. And for just a moment, I want to see a pantomime reenactment of the moment you figure it out. I want you to fully okay. immerse yourself in the moment. Uh, <clears throat> all right. Uh, ca uh, camera on, Justin. He's inflating. Oh, he's inflating. He looks like, oh, that's a good inflation. He looks good. Shaking his head. Figures out. Oh, it's hot. Uh, Ooh, it's it must sweat be like 105 degrees. Oh. Is Little that a truly? Curly. Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh, he's looking around. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. He's got the stare. He's got the fluoride stare. Who knows? He's NPCing majorly. Oh no. The C is his <laughs> silence nothing. and his shame. There's nobody to talk to right now. It's all just in your head. I'm just fucked. Uh, <laughs> I'm so <laughs> fucked. But I'm like, I'm getting in this water. And yeah. so we're I'm by a place that rents paddleboards. I, I I kept I keep going to the place which is where we rented the paddleboards the first yep. two times. Yep. It's got a drop in right next to it. So I'm like, you wanna know what? I'll bet you I can go over there. I can hay boss my way into renting a paddle from them. Just, so in other words, you want to walk over to a business that rents the exact object that you have one half of. <laughs> yes. And try to talk your way into only renting one half of the thing that they rent. Yep. Brian, if you were in this situation. Yes. And you were placed in a, a this exact scenario. Yes. Where your anger was at 100 I and might was, have already was, been in this exact and scenario. And there was a possibility where you could try to buy your way out of misery. <laughs> right. What would you do? Uh, uh, well, the, it would begin with the phrase, who likes money? <laughs> <laughs> so I, I, I go up there and I'm like, 
uh, uh, do you guys rent paddles? I have my own board. I forgot my paddle. I literally just need a paddle. Uh, and they're all 11. Like, they're yeah. like, 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 uh, I don't, like, they're all Clearasil models, like, that are 11 years old. And they're just, they have no idea. Hold just, on. Is, every, is, every word is that I'm saying. the Clearasil model, are they the before or the after? Of, a mixture of both. Okay. Uh, uh, all right, all right. A sampler platter. Sure. sure. Uh, uh, but, but, sampler platter. But they're all they're all just like 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 uh I don't I don't think so. <laughs> Where's Sarah? Can you ask Sarah? <laughs> and I'm like, no, actually, no, we can't. I'm like, can I rent a board? I want to rent a board from you right now. I'm going to leave the board here. And I'm going to take oh my God. this. I swear. I'm going to leave my it credit card. I'll leave my phone. I'll leave my ID with you. I will bring this fucking $30 piece of plastic back to you. I just want a fucking paddle. Did they say no? Ask Sarah. Where's Sarah? Uh, Where's Sarah? Sarah? I didn't even see Sarah. Sarah fucking sends word back from Mount Sinai. No fucking no. Uh, I'm like, fuck you. Fuck all of you. Fuck life. I'm fucking getting in this water. I'm getting on this goddamn paddleboard and I'm getting in the fucking water. Pause. All I want in my entire life is to believe that you grabbed one of those paddles I, no, and just ran. You can't do it because you'd have to run to the other. I, w- I would have been able to do it. <laughs> I, I, like, to pull this move it from been too Monty Python. in Austin, I would have had to like like spin move the person who's like waiting in front of me, yeah. uh, run to the end, dive in the water with the paddle, swim to the shore where my paddle board is, and then fuck off. So Wow, you re- you had the answer for that. I did. Queued up. I did. Oh. I did. It was apparently He'd well considered. Done, he'd already yeah. done the calculus. I uh, uh, so I'm so fucking pissed off. Oh. I'm so fucking pissed off Fuck. that I'm like, "Fuck it." You want to know what? I'm getting in. I'm just hand sure. swimming this shit. Just like, bored. I'm, I'm just doing bored. whatever the fuck I wanted. I'm, 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 for the record, 105 degrees with the humidity. Yes, makes you think some kooky thoughts, mainly involving. I need to be in some cold water because it's 105 it's degrees. 105 degrees. Yeah. I would like to be in the water. So I throw my shit in. I fucking take my shirt off, my shoes off. I put it in my dry bag. Uh, I, I get on my, uh, uh, my, my board. I'm paddling out. At which point, I am reminded of a common oh, no. idiom. Up Shit's Creek without a paddle. <laughs> <laughs> this is a phrase I've used a million times, never realizing that the reason why it is said is because if you are on a board without a paddle at the mercy of the tides or the winds, that you are going effectively as far, you, you have about as much mobility as you are comfortable swimming back to where you came from at the very beginning. Yeah. Uh, Justin, I know you are in state. You are telling the story very well, but I'm picturing two different scenarios. One in which you are on a paddle board trying to get somewhere without a paddle. That is pretty funny. Yeah. <laughs> now I'm picturing the version where you are furious. <laughs> and that is much funnier. Oh, and I am fucking pissed. <laughs> and so I'm like, no, I'm no, like no, these motherfuckers truly won't give me a <laughs> goddamn paddle, these <laughs> son of a bitches. And so, and so I get out there and I'm like, uh, at, at that point, I'm realizing, like, okay, I'm going to sit on my board. I'm going to get in the water and then sit on sit on the board for a second. Uh, and, I, and I can feel myself slowly moving away from civilization. Because it I'm is like, a river, right? It is a river. And uh, I, I realize... Maybe maybe I'm snapped back to my senses by at least getting in the water for but, five by, seconds. By the fever dream ending. Yeah. Uh, and so I just chug the most impotent rage IPA that you have ever seen a sad pathetic man who's been defeated on a board as he slowly drifts out (laughs) down Lady Bird Lake (laughs) fucking just like drinking my IPA like well there we go all the happiness that was that was promised to me I tried paddle boarding (laughs) once (laughs) It's a tough racket. Tough racket. 
And I'm just sitting there. I'm mad as shit. I'm just fucking annoyed. I'm just drinking my IPA. And then I start drifting further. And I'm like, how far do I want to swim after fucking just chugging this IPA? So I chug it faster. I fucking <laughs> tow my shit back to the goddamn dock. And, and I get the fuck out. And that was... My paddleboarding story. Hey! Uh, hey. Shouts out to uh, JC Calhoun who asks, uh, wasn't this an episode of Magnum PI? <laughs> 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 I think he just had to tread water for an hour. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, this is the Magnum PI episode directed by Paul Thomas Anderson. I think this is literally a King of the Hill episode, too. <laughs> oh my God. Um, Bryce, next topic! <laughs> <laughs> well, new six. news. Breaking new uh, six. A, 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 a fever dream man arri arrives on shore. Uh, dale, dale, oxen free. Uh, dude, uh, sorry we started four minutes late. I had a lot of stuff to forward over to Bryce. Uh, I got a lot of it. That were supposed to happen. Uh, I was supposed to take a shower today. I was supposed to be wearing pants today. Yeah. Yep. There He's wearing shorts. There He's was a window yeah. for all of these things. Yeah. Um, then I pressed go on my newly whitelisted Dolly account. You have a, you have a, a, we, we all got whitelisted for Dolly two. Yep. The latest in image creation, AI, machine learning. So you can, you can produce things that are photorealistic that are, uh, 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 various different art styles. Uh, it is extraordinarily powerful. So if you've seen, dolly mini which has been a, a meme on reddit that is the like joke fucking dollar store version of what is uh happening on dolly too uh we got our hands on the real sauce and along with getting your hands on the real sauce comes real rules for example no human faces yes no realistic human faces. Uh, correct uh Photorealist. no depictions of things and uh especially uh, ages or whatever like like i had to correct some words uh yeah at some point where where uh, i think i said something about uh rabbits attacking a magician and i was like oh no 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 they are around a magician yes. menacingly yeah and, uh, like like you must tread lightly because i have the strong impression in the brief two hours that vanished in an eye blink as I just kept granting wishes. I asked my family, my, uh, my daughter's in New York. My wife is in New York. Uh, I, 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 everybody's around. And I'm like, make a wish. What do you want to see? And, yeah. and, and uh, Penny dials in. And you could kind of see this journey where we start with simplistic stuff. And, and, and very quickly, it becomes like a chess game of like, okay, but I bet you, oh, you can. You know, a lot yeah. of this stuff. So, uh, uh, Bryce, are you able to sort by the order I sent you? Uh, sure. Just start describing why. Uh, sure, 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 sure. And, and uh, 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 in fact, Bryce, if, if you want to uh, take us in and just, just read whatever. I tried to keep the prompts in there because, to me, uh, uh, the more specific the prompt was, was the, the most interesting okay. part. I, I don't have them in the exact order. If that's okay, then I, I'll do that. Oh, that's fine. Okay. Yeah. Uh, well, our first one here, uh, this is the description. Uh, I'll read it off for you. Uh, the cartoon transformer Optimus Prime is sad because he just received a letter rejecting him from Harvard. His okay. three robot dogs are attempting to comfort him. He lives in Ireland. <laughs> I thought, I thought that was fairly specific and would yeah. stump the robot. Yeah. Everyone, make your bet at home about whether or not that happened. All right. Here All right. we are. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Four variations <laughs> on it. Bryce, can you can you full screen that so I can. Uh... Holy shit. <laughs> so one of them is kind of a claymation thing. Yeah. The other is a, uh, the other three are more uh, uh, like hand drawn animation, but holy shit. Optimus Prime is really sad with his <laughs> robot dog because he got rejected from Harvard. And then there's a, a UK flag in the back. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Bryce, take us forward. Sure. We've got, uh, here we go. One million golden retrievers crest the horizon during an eclipse. Uh, they didn't get to a million, but they got the gist of it. They got uh, enough. They of got it. a lot of eclipses in there. <laughs> yep. Multiple moons, multiple dogs. Is that one wearing sunglasses? Yeah. 
That's well, it, 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 Bryce, it would Bryce, be irresponsible. Bryce, it's a fucking eclipse. <laughs> like, Sorry. <laughs> you want to burn this dog's eyes out? I should out? have specified that it was a solar eclipse. That would have yeah. been better. Yeah. Um, here's one. The Statue of Liberty smells something gross. Justin, what do you think the Statue of Liberty doing something smells something gross is going to look like? I, by the way, I, by the way, I originally wrote... No, saying P-U. I originally wrote something nasty, and Dolly was like, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, you didn't say the magic word, so I changed it to I something I think it's gross. okay to say what you originally typed here. Yeah. Well, well, no, it, it refused to do it. No, yeah. no, no yeah. nasty but was what, the original yeah, word the... that he used, and it rejected oh, oh, nasty. Oh, something nasty. Nasty. And oh, so this is no. smelling yeah, yeah, yeah. something gross. <laughs> that's, that's her clearly annoyed with me. <laughs> oh, my God. She yeah. just smelled a big fart. And I like the... I like <laughs> <laughs> The crossed eyes is pretty good. I like yeah. the word art, the Microsoft word art clip art one here. Uh, all right. uh, and by the way, uh, end of the show, we are going to do live versions of these. So, you... start, yeah, start thinking so start, of your wish. Start, start thinking of good ones because at the end of the show, we are going to do them live. Don't Here... say them now. Do not. No, hold on to them. them. Hold on to your ideas. Hold Here's... on to them. A uh, pixel art podcaster mid rant. <laughs> How good do you think? Scale of one to ten. How good do you think Dolly does? A, a billion. Uh, amazing. Like, like it, it's going to be optioned for a show tomorrow. Show me a <laughs> pixel art. <laughs> that looks oh, like a I'm lot of our friends. Mid -rant. That, oh. that looks like half of the avatars in my Twitter feed. Yeah. <laughs> These are a lot of our friends. And they know who they are. Holy <laughs> shit. And, and strangely enough, they're all white guys. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, this, this person uh, might be Asian, but no. Well, well Jesus Christ. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, how about an age 1970s photo of a podcaster? Uh, <laughs> it's just a radio person, but these are AI generated. None yeah. of these people exist. None of these I, people I, exist. I asked for a specific era of time and an aged photo to match wow. it and a podcaster, and that's what uh, it imagined it to be. Uh, 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 Bryce, uh, uh, I know. Also, uh, yeah. All white guys. Again. I, yeah, well, that's true. <laughs> yeah. I, I know we only have time for a few more, but uh, we got a uh, special can one. Can you please? Yeah, can you find? Uh, 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 if that if, if this is not the next one, then uh, uh, the one about uh, uh, the crying podcaster. <laughs> Yes. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, yeah. You want yeah, crying? So, no, 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 no. Show, show okay. whatever you're about to show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this one so was then, in a group. Yeah. Uh, is in a group text, but we got the, the uh, subject here: an aged color photo of an adult gray Weimaraner with yellow eyes and a puppy Australian Shepherd with one gray eye smiling during a sunset. Now, does anybody have any idea what that might look like? Uh, probably exactly what you described. A Wegman. A Wegman. <laughs> it is. Yeah. It looks like pup. It looks like just joy and photo realistic. It like, just looks like joy and Pippi. Is that amazing? I could post yeah. that, and you would believe it. Uh, yeah. You, indeed. Um, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yes. So we've got one last one here. This is one that 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 is that is very important and near and dear <laughs> to my heart. So here we go. This is a crying podcaster. <laughs> All right, so we'll start with these first two. These Wait, no, no, no. There was fun. a longer thing. Oh, no, no, no. There's yeah. a big description. I believe there's text associated with this one that you uh, should read. <laughs> uh, you can't send me a lot of emails. Uh, I, 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 All right, here. here. If, if I remember correctly, it is a crying podcaster in telescopic view. Oh, I see. Uh, yep. He is all alone. <laughs> a telescopic photo of a podcaster crying alone in the city, seen from very far away. There we go. And we get one. <laughs> we get <a> very. <laughs> the, the bottom row is my favorite. Right, well, describe the top. Describe the top row first. So there, there, there are two average white guys with backpacks uh, crying in the Chelsea Piers. Uh, <laughs> one has got a holster for his high PR forty. For, yeah. yeah. Uh, he has a hoodie on, and it is, his face is totally covered between his hood and his uh, hands over his face. The other one has kind of just like the one <laughs> bald fist in his in his forehead because <laughs> there's one dude who's on a stool, on a stool so with he a was tripod, leaning on with a stand, a mic stand in front of him. So he was like actively doing a live remote and started crying. The other dude is on one knee because he is he is so waylaid by whatever's happening on his podcast. <laughs> they really thought he was innocent, huh? They really thought that guy didn't do it. This is great, man. Well, we'll so we'll play around with this great. later in the show too. 
<laughs> oh my oh. god. Uh, I see you says this kills stock photos. Yes. Uh, yes. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Sorry. No, no. no, no. The, Sorry, second, the, sec five. the second that this is allowed oh. to uh, uh, be commercially used, then absolutely. Oh. All right. Next. Oh, Eric. Our next topic is going to be this one. Norm joke Justin told to the Okay, quickly. <laughs> uh, so right. af after I'm um, uh, uh, a total fucking uh, 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 impotent piece of shit on the fucking river, I go same to this. Day. Same, same day. day. Same day. Hours later. Uh, uh, we're at this uh, crawfish boil that uh, the great Trey Warren had, and uh, Brian brought both Josie and Penny. Neither of whom had ever had uh, any form of a crawfish boil. And it was one of the rare opportunities where we knew there weren't no tree nuts, nuts, yeah, peanuts, yeah, 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 cross-contamination yeah. eggs. or whatever. So they also had never heard anything about Norm MacDonald. And so at some point, we're all talking about comedy. Somebody does a Norm MacDonald impression, and they're just like, huh? Huh? Who's that? Huh? And so it it uh, becomes a thing of trying to explain Norm MacDonald to these people who have never heard of of of, of, of the man for, uh, for context, as we understand now, you've had a day. It's still over 100 degrees. Yeah. I've had seven beers. The sun is down. It's still 100 degrees. My 14-year-old and my 18-year-old are trying to understand comedy, and they're game. We're all waiting for, you know, bugs to eat. Yep. And uh, and 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 where uh, uh, you and me and Andrew Heaton are explaining some bits about comedy or whatever, and then we get the questions like, "Well, how do you explain Norm Macdonald?" And so people start going back and forth, and they're, they're <coughs> trying to explain what Norm Macdonald is, and uh, 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 eventually they're they're game for it, they're they're enjoying it, and I'm like, "Well, there is this quintessential Norm Macdonald joke that was one of the first Norm Macdonald jokes that I remember really loving," which. Uh, uh, for the record, I did not know what you were teeing up at no, this moment. No. And so uh, I, I was uh, uh, explaining, like, all right, so the, I heard him tell this. It's part of his stand-up act, but I first heard him tell this on a talk show. Uh, he's like, uh, uh, you know, uh, you ever you, you see these uh, gay pride parades, right? <laughs> and you have the really old guy and his wife, and they're standing next to each other, and the guy's got a sign above his head that says, uh, we're proud of our gay son. Just real, real quick pause. The sun is down. It's over 100 degrees. <laughs> yes. My 14-year-old daughter, my 18-year-old daughter, learning yeah. about comedy, yeah. all of us waiting to hear this mm -hmm. joke. Well, you know, like, uh, that's not true, right? <laughs> you know, you're really, you're proud of your son. Like, yeah, you know, never... Sitting there, lunchtime at the union job, your buddy. Oh, and you're classic, like uh, classic norm. He's like, gonna get like, context. Uh, it's gonna land. You stepping on it? No, no, no. <laughs> I'm, I'm explaining my my thoughts yeah. at this moment. You're like a heckler. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, 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 so you know, uh, 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 you're never gonna go to your friend and be like, "Well, you know, our buddy or our buddy, our, our, our son." Uh, uh, you know, he went to college and uh, graduated first in his class. And uh, he's, he's just going in the workforce. He's working in plastics. So proud of him. Anyway, here's a picture of him sucking a man's cock. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> you did it. That was a one-for-one -one simulation of that moment. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, Went over about as well there as it did here. <laughs> it's a good joke. It's a funny uh, joke. It it's is well. a really good joke. It's a really funny joke. But uh, yeah, as it turns out, the the uh, uh, eighteen year old and the fourteen year old were were uh, different time. I, and 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 to all of our credit, uh, they said, "Huh." <laughs> 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 uh, huh. Yeah. Anyway, if you want a good version of that, watch Norm tell it. Yeah. <laughs> also, be 20 years older <laughs> because 14-year-olds and 18-year-olds. No, no, but I, I heard that joke when I was 14. Sure. Like. Also, attitudes about homosexuality were a little bit different at the time. But that's, I don't know. I feel like that joke is weirdly progressive. 
Uh, it was for the time, but now. No, I think now it is. I, where, where, I think are, it's, where are we? It's about it's about it's about that you're proud of your uh, your, your your child that 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 sexuality does not define you. Isn't that what the point of progress is? Uh, is sexually comment, open. We go to our apex gay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it, Bryce, you need to figure out a better walk on for that. <laughs> okay, all right. <laughs> <laughs> but, no, I mean like it's you. You're you're demonstrating a good relationship with your parents. Uh, yeah, that I, open I, conversation. You you know, no taboo topics. I, I, no. I just think like like that sign. Even then, God, we're breaking down the Norm Macdonald. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that sign then was a sign of a sick society. A sign where where that was not the norm. Correct. Where you would not be. Like yeah. proud of your of your gay son, and so you had to make a sign because that was odd. I think that that we are at at a point where the cultural tipping point has moved the other direction, where now like that is not you. You would see something if somebody wanted to be supportive. If a parent wanted to be supportive, right. they'd probably signal to an issue or something like that, as as opposed to like oh, sure. I'm here because my son's gay. Like that is. A, a, a alpha version of of progress. So I weirdly think it is a, a uh, no, no, no. And, and and I do agree it's a progressive joke. And it, it like um, uh, it, God, this is even more boring than me retelling a norm joke. I this didn't even, even say I'm, very I'm, much. I'm fucking killing it. No, I am. I'm <laughs> saying too much. I'm Brian, saying you too fucking. Much. What is going on? This is a, oh. I agree. <laughs> Next topic. Sweet tooth. I found a funny video online the other day. <laughs> what is okay, by the way, what you just heard, ladies and gentlemen, is a moment where neither Brett nor Brian nor Justin knew what this was, and we were all hoping it was not something we <laughs> said in the pre-production <laughs> meeting. <laughs> and we were all very happy when you said you found a video. <laughs> I found a fun, cute video the other day. What's the thing about bears? What's the thing about cartoon bears? What Describe a cartoon bear. They oh, always get picnic into honey. baskets. They like picnic baskets. They have what do you smaller say, versions of themselves that are their sidekicks. That they explain everything to. They, they, get, their, they get their butts stuck in trees. And they're 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 heads. oh yeah they sell uh, toilet paper yes <laughs> Jesus they say oh bother a lot yeah they they're buy, British they buy butthole <laughs> products so uh, uh, they buy butthole products yeah. yes <laughs> so this is from a uh, tie among animals on uh, TikTok uh, someone asks do bears really like honey and if so I need proof what do you think do bears like honey uh well. Hell yeah. Uh, uh, I bet you uh, they're all up into that shit. I bet they definitely like honey. I'm not sure what he's holding in this image. It looks like he's about to spray them with a spray bottle of, of Bear Be Gone. No, that's, well, let's... Here, honey, you want some? It's a little honey bottle. Yeah. What is he... Okay. So bears so... do really enjoy honey. But what's interesting is they don't just break into the hives for the sweet stuff. No, they also eat the grubs and the adult bees for protein. Uh, uh, pause. Uh, um, I feel like we just saw a one-two punchline setup. Uh, <laughs> where <laughs> yeah, they have the bear has now consumed the honey part, and the guy has just said they also like protein <laughs> while the bear's mouth is on the guy's hand. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. So there's the end of it. it. There, there can't be anything else that can happen after this. Uh, would you would you let a bear eat honey out of your hand like that? Because that's this, that, that this bear. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Is that the end of the video? No. Yeah, that's the end of it. Wait, that it is? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> it is. Wait, it's a TikToker, so you oh, make some it. I know, right? Oh, but, I thought that dude was about <sighs> to get saved, his Justin. bitten <laughs> off. Wait a minute. Yeah, wait. Did I wasn't going like... to bring a fucking snuff video to <laughs> Great Night. No. What the fuck? Wait, yeah, wait, hold on. That's it? That's it. It's cute. You didn't like jizz his pants or anything? Like, <laughs> like. <laughs> Look at it. He puts his little arm on his arm. He puts his paw on his arm. Wait. So bears do. So really literally, all right, for, for audio listeners, uh, uh, it's literally just an adorable bear eating oh. honey out of this uh, 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 weird ginger's palm. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, it's wholesome. It's wholesome. Would you do it? Would you let a bear do that to you? I mean, uh, if I were if I were the fucking bear marshal, yeah. Like yeah. if I were around <laughs> bears all the time, hold like on, I would hold on. sure, yeah. Who is that? How does one get the job of bear marshal? <laughs> well, you position? go to bear community college, you get a bear certificate, and 
you know, you do your residency in, in San Francisco, <laughs> and then you got back. Seventeen bears. Go district. Do yeah. they be like A, B, C, or D? And you kind of nudge the hand over to B, and then, and then you get the bear. And then you get the bear. You get the bear certificate. Yeah. And then you you go to bear finishing school. Yep. And you have you to get run your, your, the tri your... bear tournament. That's, you gotta, that's you, right. You get, uh, your, you get your BHD. <laughs> yeah, that's right. You get your you, BHD. You also right. play the last starfighter a lot. You play the uh-huh. last <laughs> bear fighter. <laughs> yeah. You play the bear hunter a lot. Yeah, and exactly. they're all like, you've done it. And then you enter into the <laughs> ah. bear games. <laughs> and you're listening on. Uh, and then, but at first, it's your sister that is selected. You go, <laughs> I, I serve as bear tribute. And then you go in for that. And then you chop off Ned Stark's head. <laughs> And you, definitely, you definitely <laughs> don't watch the Grizzly Man. You do not. You do watch not. The no, you do not. You do but watch. You do talk like Werner Herzog for the rest of this bit. <laughs> That's very true. And then you, and okay. then you go that to the bear community video. college. Yeah. There's a very good bear accreditation. Would you put the honey upon your palm and let its rough, smooth tongue <laughs> lap the sweet nectar from your hand? Yes, I would, Bryce. <laughs> I would do it morning, noon, and night. Wow. I would explain it to the TikTok so the For You page would educate the world. Yeah, but uh, Werner Herzog, yes. how would you pay for this whole shenanigan? I would go to patreon.com <laughs> slash great night. <laughs> there I would I would make my bear companion go to his tiny she computer. You would make the bear. Yes. Well, we have a working a relationship. Night. I've done his laundry and he <laughs> owes me one. He has a small computer for bear hand <laughs> and he uses his paws to go to patreon.com slash night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, oh! Now you get to keep going. He has a bear computer. (laughs) It's so much better. And a bear credit card. And he he reaches into his little bear pants. And he pulls out his bear credit card. And he signs up for patreon.com slash great night. There he gets... Not only the satisfaction of knowing that an independent comedy show is being made just for his little bear brain, but also he gets a bonus episode that happens up to five times a month. He's so satisfied. He looks, he licks the screen thinking there is honey, but there is no honey. There is only the satisfaction of going to patreon.com slash great night. <laughs> Uh, uh, ladies and gentlemen, Justin yeah. Robert Young, the ultimate ad read. Uh, head on over to patreon.com slash great night and make sure to get the bones, the bonuses, the extras, the extra bones, the boner uh, USA. Yes. Get the boner USA, everybody. <laughs> boner Sagal. Up, down, 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 boner USA. <laughs> uh... Hey Bryce, hey. we have a game. We do have Perchance. a game. Perchance, chance, young Bryce. Perchance. We have a game. I'm sorry. I, I, I legitimately kind of need a moment to process how awesome that minute was. <laughs> <laughs> I was not ready for that. <laughs> uh, so uh, I think it's well documented on this show that I can be a little grinchy. What? A little grinchiness. What? Um, and so, uh, you know, I, I thought I'd share maybe just a little bit. But, you know, I hate children. I like to dunk on them. Just really... Take them to school any chance I get. It's my yeah. favorite thing. You like to take children to school? <laughs> <laughs> Isn't kinda, that kind of where children should why be? Why are Bryce? you saying like that? That's a creepy thing yeah. to do. It that seems like a fairly really normal thing. <laughs> if you were if you were into doing that, Brian would have been really happy that I mean, you could take his children to school. If, if that was a non weird phenomenon for you, like I I I, I don't like yeah, doing you would, it. Yeah, you would actually just be Mr. Belvedere. <laughs> <laughs> so I've cooked up a Yeah, brand. I take the children to school. I make the children the lunch. I dunk on them. I dunk on, on them. But then I give them a lesson. <laughs> the lesson is you don't fuck with the apex. You don't fuck yeah. with the apex. <laughs> <laughs> 
That was an accident. Uh, so I've cooked up with this new game called Kids Tell the Stupidest Jokes. Hey! Hey! So I went on I went online and pulled the punchlines to jokes that were submitted to at Kids Write Jokes on Twitter, which shares quotes. Uh, genuine joke attempts by children, unquote. You will have to guess the punchline to these setups. The closest will get a point as determined by science. Brett, would you like to play? I would love to play. Okay, I, do you mind I, keeping score while we do so? I will keep score. Thank you very much. Attempt is a bit of a telling word there, right? Uh, kids attempt to tell a joke. I mean, uh, we have attempted to tell jokes for over 10 years. So We're, We'll get it someday. One day. One day. All right, so our first question here, uh, Justin, we're going to start with you. Yep. Uh, your question is, what do babies want for Christmas? <laughs> All right, so we're thinking of what the the punchline punch line is. is. What's the punchline yeah. to what do babies want from Christmas? You gotta really get into kids. Just like just Brian, get Brian Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, audio <laughs> listeners. You you were spared on that one. <laughs> I'm gonna walk over here and my <laughs> white claw. Just give me a moment. Justin, what do babies want for Christmas? What do babies want for Christmas? A goo goo Santa. A goo goo Santa, Justin says. All right, Brian, what do you say? What do babies want for Christmas? So, so we don't know the voice of this Twitter account because the uh, kids do say. Crazy thing. The things. dumbest shit. Yeah. The dumbest shit. Um, yeah. Uh, to know their real dad's name. <laughs> to, kid, babies want to know their real dad's name. <laughs> babies. <laughs> well, I'm just now saying the word baby. Yeah. <laughs> Too late. <laughs> sure. I'm already committed. Yeah. Let's hope that Brett does better than either of us. Gotcha. Brett, what do you think? What do babies want for Christmas? Toys, duh. <laughs> Toys, duh. <laughs> Oh shit, that's a good one. Because <laughs> you know what, babies are like. Could I please have a toy? Duh. Can I? Duh. Duh. Can I have a toy? All right. When, uh, when, when does a child develop the phrase "duh" as somebody who has raised three of well, them, all, all of whom presumably know how to say "duh"? I, I think you're thinking about this the wrong way. Oh. Because the oh. question is not. I'm not asking this is, a no, question. This, I'm asking. A, I'm asking a father good. about uh, when duh this, happens. He doesn't know anything. This is <laughs> Jesus. This, this is good parenting. Keep going. Yeah. Uh. Uh. uh <laughs> I, I don't know. Oh, you know what? It's probably when they say da da, huh? Uh. Da da. Oh, boy. <laughs> duh. It's it's around the time they realize the perfect response to negative tweets is toy. Yeah. yeah, boy. yeah. There we go. Uh, Justin, what was your answer again? You said Goo Goo Dolls? Uh, uh, yes. Uh, no, I, I said <laughs> the band. Goo Goo, goo, goo Santa. Goo so goo instead of Goo Goo Gaga, Goo Goo Santa. Goo Goo Santa, I see. Yeah. Sorry, Goo Goo Dolls. They, they uh, understand the concept of Santa. Uh, Brian said, uh, no, no, these are kids writing jokes about babies. <laughs> right? So they're right. older kids. Oh, wait. Writing okay. Jokes Maybe about I have a chance. Sure. Yeah. With, with, with the, to know their parents, to the, know the, their yeah. dad's name. Now, I don't think that they know the generational pain of. Of a broken lineage. <laughs> You'd be surprised. But, they grow up so fast. They do. <laughs> uh, Brian said to know their real dad's name, and Brett said, Toys, duh. The answer that we are looking for is I swear if it's Goo Goo Santa. All they teeth. <laughs> <laughs> Good joke. It's we are looking joke. for all they teeth. All they Good teeth. joke. I didn't know that the real bit was us all getting schooled by children. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> well, no. Now we know we have to think of good punchlines. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yeah. All right. So, so now we're outriding them. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, that was a Brian point, by the way. Uh, yeah. The fuck? Yeah. yeah. To know their parents. It's all they teeth. To know their dad's name. Yeah. It's, uh, it's very real. It's, it's very, very real. real. Gritty <laughs> reboot. <laughs> like Zack Snyder's child writing jokes. Do you want to know how I was born without teeth? <laughs> <laughs> that the Joker. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. But then, but then he gives a different answer every time. And yeah. So it's fine. Yeah. That'd be more Nolan. Oh. Snyder would be Jared Leto. Yeah. yeah. What would that sound like? <laughs> I'm. It's morbid time. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's. A, you saved it. You landed. Yeah. 
Yeah. <laughs> All right, next question. All right, that was a Brian point. Uh, right, we're going to start with Brian on this one. Brian. Yep. What does a computer do when it's on a star? <laughs> runs a star saver. Brian says runs a star oh. saver. Wow, okay. Kids know about screen savers? Uh, <laughs> we'll find out. <laughs> <laughs> what does a computer do when it's on a star? Yeah, what's it do, Justin? No, it's me. No, it's Brett. It's me. No, I'm asking. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Brian wants to know what you think. No, Brett, what does a computer do when it's on a star? I am not good at this. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Brett, 30 minutes ago, be on the show, compete on the game? Yeah. Sure. Be on the game? Oh, oh fuck. fuck. <laughs> uh, and, uh, I do I have nothing. I actually have nothing. Uh, okay, I'm okay. gonna. Yeah, it's an abstention. Yeah, I'm just gonna mark you down as an I X. Got nothing. Okay, Justin. I can't think of anything clever. So what I does a computer do? When neither it's on can a kids. That's the whole bit. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of the whole bit here. Yeah. What does a computer do when it's on a star? They shine brightly. Go ahead and write that one down for Brett. <laughs> <laughs> okay, shine brightly. Sure. Yeah. In that voice. <laughs> and then put funny voice. Funny voice. Okay, Justin, what does a computer do when it's on a star? YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, it's pretty good. But, uh, final answer, YouTube. <laughs> yep. Okay, there we go. So our answers are, Brian said a star saver. Brett. Uh, they shine brightly. They shine brightly. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, can, can, I got to hear the funny voice. They shine brightly. They shine brightly. <laughs> And just how I sound? Yep. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that to the man. <laughs> and Justin, you said YouTube. Yeah. We were looking for... <laughs> it keeps on. It keeps on doing the words. <laughs> <laughs> man. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think it's definitely not a screensaver because it keeps doing the words. Okay, I'll take your word for it. Well, I'm going to have to ask science here. Come Excuse on, me. you Shh. son of a bitch. Come on. All right. All right. Oh, Justin gets the pole. Hey. Sure he does. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Brett. Thank you for the backup. Yes. Oh. You didn't fucking Can guess, my guy. What? <laughs> you literally abstained. I'm not complaining. I you're like the motherfucker that, that is like, a, you know, measure control. This is Houston. Uh, how's it up there on the moon? Always great. Okay, we're measuring gravity on the moon. We need you to nothing. drop a hammer. Drop a hammer and go. How long did it take? Three seconds. And it was like, three seconds. Okay. <laughs> sure it did. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sure. Sure. That sounds, sure. 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 That's yeah. really realistic. Good, Good yeah. job. Okay. Good job yeah. there. Okay. Yeah. Thanks. Eh. All right. I got a question for you. Brett, we're going to start with you on this one. Oh, boy. Brett, what do aliens eat? What do aliens eat? Come on. Think like a bad comedy writer. Yeah. Uh, what do aliens eat? Alien ants. <laughs> Alien ants. Alien. Okay, alien ants. I've just, you know. Justin, <laughs> what do aliens eat? Uh, everybody at home, what he's writing on his pad is, never play a game again. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of hort? Uh, okay. What do aliens eat? Justin. Moon butts. <laughs> Moon butts, he says. Yeah. Brian Brushwood, what do aliens eat? I, 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 to be honest, I think Justin got a perfect score. <laughs> but if I was going to plus it for age, it would be moon poon. Wow. Jesus Christ. Uh, wait a that's, minute. Oh, really? That's, that's a this guy just told the Norm MacDonald joke, and I'm the bad guy for aging it up a bit. How dare <laughs> From you? From eating ass, How eating pussy. You? Okay, I'm the bad guy. Oh, All dare right. You. <laughs> Oh, All right. All right. <laughs> moon, moon. <laughs> I mean, where do you go from that? Then the kids joke. <laughs> the kids joke is moon poon. They put that you in a also have to do the dance. Larry, Larry Prince Hustler presents Moon Poon. <laughs> now I'm sorry, Brendan. You said science there was a fiction adventure that you'll never believe and never forget. 
And Brian, did you say that there was a moon poon dance, or was I hearing? Yeah, this? what's the moon poon dance? <laughs> Let's do it together. <laughs> I, I, yeah, can, we, can we do the moon poon dance together? <laughs> I was trying. Come on, here we go. Put down your claw. Let's do the moon poon dance was, together. Okay, yeah. I was, I was uh, trying to do it. All right, all right. Uh, yeah, can we have some music? Because obviously you don't do it without music. You don't do it without right, music. Come on, man. <laughs> some oh, all right, all right. Uh, all right. As you know, we approach each other at first, and then yeah. it all happens yeah. on the moon. Right? On the moon. Okay. Do we have music? Okay, here we go. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this is so. Oh. <laughs> WatchGreatNight.com will take you to our YouTube page. To I don't know that That's I can describe this on Twitch. I that think I will can't, be a TikTok. I can't describe this. That's uh, terms of service. As community Dolly. guidelines. <laughs> Yeah, boom, boom. Anyway, my ass is looking good. I think, man. <laughs> like, it's because you're wearing pants. God, I knew I should have worn pants. He needed chinos. All right, so your answers were Brett said alien ants. That's what aliens eat. <laughs> New TikTok dance just dropped. <laughs> New moon TikTok. Moon challenge. Moon Poon Challenge. <laughs> Are you ready for the Moon Poon Challenge? Okay, my niece told me about the moon burn challenge. Here I go. <laughs> Hold on, let me set down my red wine. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, and uh, Justin said moon butts. Brian said moon coon. <laughs> By the way, are we sure that's the historical record? Yes. Okay. I wrote it down. Yeah. Uh, the answer we were looking for was... I swear to God, moon poon. Come what on. do aliens eat? Eyes that have been dropped on the floor. That's alien ants, baby. Yeah. Oh, shit. Because ants have eyes. Because ants have eyes. Yeah. Thank you, Brett. Yeah. And they've been dropped on the floor by God. Make, make fun of me, will you? Oh, no. I, I, I was. I, I mean, was, make fun of me, will you? I, I, uh, 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 you're so silly and handsome. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Yeah. You're like God dropped eyes. You want to and... come moon poon dance real quick? <laughs> <laughs> like, Bob, my, I pulled a muscle. Uh -oh. <laughs> I'm sure you did, homie. <laughs> Always say no to moon poon dance. He's writing <laughs> moon poon, not even once. <laughs> not even once. All right. Uh, after three rounds, Brett, what is our score? Well, uh, Justin, you have one point. Mm. Brian, you have one point. Yep, I do. And Brett, you suck, but you only have one point. Yeah. There we go. Thank you, Brett. Could have positioned all of us as winners. That's fine. <laughs> well, well, what's next? All right. Uh, we're going to start with you on this one, Justin. Yep. <laughs> I just realized I was saying moon poon. <laughs> yeah, man, you said a really funny thing. You just yeah. said oh, moon poon. You then explained it and said... How would I not escalate eating ass to eating pussy? Yeah, and then I, and then that's what you said and about after, on the moon. After I was, and then we did the moon poon dance. Yeah, yes. and then we were finally past the bit, and in that brief moment of escape, I said the words, "Whoa!" <laughs> I said moon poon. Yeah, and, yeah. And now we're here. This, okay. Uh, okay. So the Norm McDonald. <laughs> this January six committee meeting is really not what I thought it would be. <laughs> All right. Uh, there's Brian a felt a tremendous regret <laughs> from bringing it back to Moon Poon. <laughs> Long ago, his bond. lunar his lunar miscreant uh, actions behind him for only just a moment when the tiny bear looked at his Twitch chat and said, LOL, why won't he stop? <laughs> <laughs> Justin, we're going to start with you on this one. Yes. Question. I guess it's a setup to a joke. Why do monkeys swing? <laughs> that is uh, M-O-N-K-Y-S. Why do monkeys swing? Uh, <laughs> unsatisfactory marital sex. Oh. Yep. <laughs> unsatisfactory. We're all on the same page on this one. <laughs> Brian, why do monkeys... But only one of us has their Yo. wife here. Because <laughs> your mama's fat. <laughs> oh. oh! That's what a kid would say. That's what a kid would say. Cause your mama's fat. Cause your mama's fat. Get on your mama's back. Cause <laughs> big. Oh, I, I children, I don't recommend you do that. Get on your mama's back. No, you don't do that. 
Why not? Well, I'm a 150 pound man, so that's probably not gonna be great. <laughs> yeah, but for you ever, you ever surprise your mom by just jumping on her back real quick? <laughs> I don't. Uh, uh, Brett, why do monkeys swing? You want to call your mom, see if it's okay? No, thank you. <laughs> just <laughs> ask her real quick. No. No? We can't do that. Do that. Soft no, hard no. <laughs> Very hard no. Oh, oh, that one's all right. You Brett! That. Yeah. Can you get her to do the moon spoon <laughs> yeah. dance? Brett, why do monkeys swing? We got, a, we got a laundry list of questions here, Bryce. <laughs> why we do could monkeys just get your mom on the horn. <laughs> why do monkeys Yeah, swing? we could just get your mom on the horn. We could, we could bust through these real fast. <laughs> Brett, ignore the one you monkeys swing. Two minutes You and me, look at me right here. Look at me right here. Look at me. Look at me. Why do monkeys swing? Well... Because, because that's how they get the bananas. Okay, that's how uh, they get the bananas. Thank you. Huh. All right. Yeah. <laughs> not not fans of because they, that's how they get the bananas. No, that's fine. It's great. Yeah, it's good. Is it's that good. is that too hey, much of a monkey I, it's stereotype? Very funny. I didn't do it's a wife swap. Hey, I didn't very do a wife swapping joke. All right. Explanatory. Well, I mean, yeah, true. Factually correct. <laughs> yeah. Factually Is it correct. Too late you didn't to change my answer to jungle poo. <laughs> <laughs> you want to change your answer from only if you have, only if you make up a new dance. We well, do have to see what the jungle poo do it with me. <laughs> only if we do it right now. <laughs> oh, play that music. All right, ready? Here we go. <laughs> Watch great night. Oh. <laughs> That is factually correct. Yes, accurate. That one sucked. That one was very not good. <laughs> that one sucked compared to the one where we rubbed our butts together. On the I mean, we could do both. No, you've ruined the moment. Move on. <laughs> Who won? All right, the answer that we were looking for was. I love the sincere review. Not as good as Moon Poon Dance. <laughs> Why do monkeys swing? Because they think they are special. True. I, I don't know who of us was closest. That's actually not a bad joke. Yeah. Uh, I kind of feel like... Mm, uh, yeah, well, I'm going to put this in the science computer and find out. special. Shh. Oh, here we go. That's a Brett point. Oh, 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 now the game's good. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, just a few more here. Uh, <laughs> Brian, we're gonna start with you. Yep. What did the guy say to the guy? <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> what did the guy say to the guy? He this said, this one. This is a great one. Yeah, I love this one. Yeah. This is a classic. He what said, did the guy? He said, sorry, there's a guy, right? A what guy. did the guy say to the guy? <laughs> the guy. He said, uh, he said, hold my truly. I'm gonna borrow your pump. Hold my truly. I'm well, topical. Point. Sure. <laughs> well, topical. Okay. Uh, All Brett. politics are local, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> what global version of this would you... <laughs> Let me hold your oil. <laughs> it would be. Yeah. It would be a spin drift instead of a truly. Okay. Uh, Brett, why did what did the guy say to the guy? How about that 911? <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I don't know if you're mad because the joke was uncouth or you didn't make it. <laughs> I'm, I, I'm mad because I'm going to be credited with it <laughs> long. Like, that shit's going to be on a plaque somewhere misattributed to me. Yeah. Yep. It's Abraham Lincoln. Yep. Justin, what did the guy say to the guy? Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> he said shut up, did he? Yeah. Actually, I, 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 think, yeah. I think you won no matter what the result yeah. is. All right, let's find out. Brian said, uh, uh, who, who remembers? I don't Brian quite said. remember something with a bike pump. Brett said, uh, how about that? 9 11. 9 11. Yeah. <laughs> and Justin said, shut up. We were looking for. What did the guy say to the guy? Hi, I'm a guy. <laughs> hey. That was going to be, I was going to do, hey, guy. I thought that was it. What, that's what I was going to do. Well, I would hate to be science Hold right about now. Sign. We're proud of our guy son. <laughs> <laughs> guy is NPC month. All right. Uh, I meant you. I fucked that whole thing up. All right. Uh, no, 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 I, I was there for it. It was okay. good. It was good. Uh, that's a Justin Poor. Hey! All right. It's time for our final round. Brett, what is the score? The score is 
Justin has two points. Right. Brian has one point. That's right. And Brett justifiably has two points. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh. This is sure. maybe a little editorializing, but okay. Thank oh, you very I'm much. I'm a guy. We should never let the scorekeeper play. Again. Hey. <laughs> hey. Just hey. saying. Hey. There's got to be lines. Yeah, that's true. Hi, I'm a guy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, guy. Hey. Hey, 9 my 11. Guy. Hey, my guy. Hey. hey. What about that 9 11? <laughs> Funnier every time. Uh, like, all right. Uh, Brian, because you are in the back of the pack, you are going to guess first on this one. Yes. The setup is. What do you call a camel with three legs? <laughs> this is from Matt Kids Right Jokes. What do you call a camel with three legs? Brian, we're going to go with you first. What do you call a camel with three uh, legs? Okay, 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 okay. So a camel. 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 Camel's camel. got humps. 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 Yep. My lovely camel. Two humps. Three legs. Yeah. Two humps, three legs. One uh, drive. <laughs> three, three orifices. Uh, oh, uh, whoa, whoa, hey. Wow. Hey. What do you call a camel hey. with three legs? Um, call a camel with three legs. What do you call it? Lucky. Okay. 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 Brian's going to say lucky. Brett, okay. what do you call a camel with three legs? Eileen. God damn it. That's, a, that's a real joke. Yeah, it's a real that's, joke. I don't know how I feel about yeah. this. All right. Justin, what do you call a camel with three legs? Proof that God's a sociopath. <laughs> is, it, is it too late to change my answer to my lovely leaning humps? <laughs> yeah. No. It is unfortunate. Yeah. It is uh, unfortunate. Sorry. that we had, We've already sent it off to the accountants to figure out the votes. All right. Yeah. Your guesses were. Why do you call a camel with three legs? Brian said lucky. Brett said Eileen. Yes. I just said uh, because it's proof that God is a sociopath. <laughs> we were looking for. When you say it out loud, it sounds weird. <laughs> <laughs> what do you call a camel with three legs? Pregnant! <laughs> hey! Um. <laughs> I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to give this one to science though, because this is a pretty difficult this one. This one's pretty. I don't know. It's pretty clear to me. It's clear to me. I think it's clear to me too. I mean, they, I they, think it's very they say, clear. They say every, every, my every baby is a blessing, so I'd say that was pretty lucky. I think it's clear that obviously God is a sociopath and creates children. <laughs> so wait, like, uh, but wow. Isn't, don't think about it too okay. hard. What are you, a theologian? Uh. I'm more in, uh, I'm actually on Brian's team. On this one. <laughs> You're giving up your spot. You're I'm cheering saying, for me. I okay. Think, I'm, a, I'm fair. I'm a fair guy. <laughs> All right. All right, everybody. We've got a result here. Four. And also, this was worth five points for five points <laughs> oh, in the game. <laughs> oh, wow. You almost missed it. That was almost great. Justin gets the ball. <laughs> Shit. Fuck All you, right. Brett. Yeah. <laughs> Eat shit. You know what? Wait till next week when I get to score. I don't I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That was That's that was right. <laughs> uh, if, right. Sorry. If, I don't know who's messing with who right now. I need to shave my this head. Is very, I need to shave my head. Where again, do it, I, I know then you'd bully me. Yeah. 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 Right now you're bull you're bullyable. Hey man. Bullyable? You're bullyable. There's like only that. room for one bully. On this show, and that is the chat room. True. <laughs> That's that true. true. That's true. Uh, if you have an idea for a game like this, just a simple trivia game, send it to our email, greatnightpod at gmail.com. Of course, you can check it in the show notes wherever you listen to or enjoy this. Uh, and follow us on uh, YouTube. Watch Great Night is, uh, uh, or watchgreatnight.com will get you there. Uh, of course, we are on TikTok at, uh, at Great Night Pod, I believe. And uh, that will, uh, we've got a lot of funny clips there. So thank you everybody for following us there and uh, enjoying the whole thing. By the way, made my day to find out that Tom Merritt, like uh, eventually <laughs> TikTok gets your number and figures out that you only want like two or three things. And one of those three things that Tom Merritt wants is clips of great night. Hey! Right. So make sure to keep going clipping that stuff. That's right. It's, it's between that, clips of BTS. And marbles races. So. Yeah, three <laughs> three great things that taste great, great together. together. Taste great together. That's right. Uh, thank you. Uh, All right.
Bryce. We do have the, th the next thing set up and ready. Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. Good. So, so here, here's what we're gonna do. And I'm sorry, this is not a great, uh, this is not a great uh, uh, audio bit, but you should follow us on TikTok, where we will post the best versions of of these on that. That's correct. But the shit that you're gonna want to see. Uh, is going to be there. I think it'll be pretty watch clear. On watch Great Night, whether or not we land this one. Well, no, but but, but like, uh, you have to see these yes. because they are exquisite, incredible, and we're going to do this live. So what we want is people to give us Dolly to prompts, and we are going to literally enter them in into this beautiful, amazing AI. It is going to spit out several different versions of it. So like what Brian did earlier, I tried the really more hard. Complex the better, and we will pick the best from the chat room. Things that the Dolly 2 engine appears to like from my experience, very limited, only two hours before I ran out of coupons, and it <laughs> said you should have taken a shower and put on pants. Uh, uh, it lights, right here, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. How about this? That while, while you explain this, a Ninja Turtle chugging a beer while watching hockey on a very comfy beanbag chair. That's good. All right, we're plugging uh, that in. It takes a second to load, so yeah, it's perfect. Okay. Well, Troy, uh, yeah, oh, 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 so we have enough coupons. We could do a few of these. Uh, yeah. Ooh, tasty. Okay. Uh, also, it likes uh, contextualizing things like a sinister or a, a assuming motivation. Yes, correct. Yeah. It also Emotion likes and specific motivation. art styles. One of the ones that blew me away the most was like a macro photography miniature. Of, so, so it was one of those where it's like it looked like, you know, uh, backgrounds all out of focus, foregrounds all yeah. out of focus, that kind of thing. All right. We've got we, 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 we were shown an example of of a, a, a movie character as a wood relief that blew my mind. OK, this is a great one here. This is a, a Ninja Turtle chugging a Coors <laughs> while watching hockey on a very comfy beanbag chair. And oh my goodness. Holy. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like oh, actual no. photos in people's homes. I mean, not only not only does it look like a real life photo, but them turtles are way into the game. Yeah. <laughs> Either that or really annoyed. I love it's the like they're gambling picture. against each other. So they are they are that. all they look like felt creation. <laughs> yes. And they are watching TV. <laughs> they have drinks in their hands and they are really fucking into it. <laughs> uh, top left is my vote. That's got to be the winner, right? Yeah, the one with the slack jaw. Uh, weirdly, the TV is not <laughs> looking at the TV. <laughs> he probably has two TVs. Okay. He's got two TVs. <laughs> He's got two TVs and two couches, neither of which is facing towards the other TV. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there we go. So that's a good one. We'll uh, I'll, I'll click save on that one. Okay. Uh, 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 other prompts here. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. I, a three-legged camel who is obviously pregnant and <laughs> underwhelmed at the punchline of a joke. That's pretty oh. good. Okay. That's pretty good. A three-legged cable <laughs> that is obviously pregnant and <laughs> underwhelmed at the punchline of a joke. All right, we're loading it up oh, here. <laughs> that, that one came from All live right, in, that, in that, the that, in the call is coming audience. from inside the house. <laughs> oh, my God. I need bio uh, Here we go. <laughs> Whoa, Jesus. Oh, oh, no. We won't look at that one, but... Uh, uh, these all have four legs, I think. Oh, you know what? That might be a... Um, they have some safety things so oh, that wait. it doesn't oh, generate oh, oh, gross There stuff. is one with a very big penis. <laughs> I think well, that's what they meant by three-legged camel. Yeah, that's yeah. a leg. That's a leg. Yeah. All right. <laughs> and so uh, I, I think what happens is uh, that might be something that it says, hey, if you try to tell it three legs, it's going to show you an amputation. <laughs> so we're not going to do Got it. So it might be over the line. So yeah. way to be gross. That's right. Hey, uh, way to fuck it up, buddy. Uh, okay, hold on. I got one for you. I got one for you. Trap. Distressed man trying to pump up his paddle board, <laughs> but realizes he forgot his paddle. paddle. <laughs> All right, we're kicking it up. I might get this. I might get this hand painted uh, and, and hung uh, in my I mean, in my study. It, it also likes it if you add a style. So if you say like in pixel art or in oil or or or. Uh, uh. All right, here we go. This is uh, this is the man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, Justin. Justin, we're gonna go through what this is before. actually giving me PTSD. <laughs> 
scroll this down. Is the greatest scroll thing down. We've ever done. No! <laughs> no! What what I like is you have an umbrella, like an outdoors um, pat a, patio umbrella You're base instead of a, a puddle. Oh, shovel. <laughs> it's weird because it's an actual picture of Justin Robert Young. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this guy's. <laughs> this, is so good. this dude is like he realizes he brought his foosball table handle instead of a foosball. instead of a paddle. <laughs> this has got got, got a uh, ski pole. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is the best bit ever. <laughs> okay, okay, uh, uh, okay. Do we have a favorite of these? Yes, a bear hungry licks oh. honey off a man's arm. <laughs> no, wait, no, no, no. Hold on, no. Let, let, let's oh. do one. Let's do one in a in a style. Okay, uh, like, like uh, so. So if, if we do a anime. bear licks honey off a man's hand, then let's do it in in some kind of form. Okay, uh, in uh, the style uh, of in the style of Lisa Frank. Yes, oh. perfect. <laughs> Generate. All right, it'll take a second. Where's Wait, Salvador? That's no move. Dolly. I guess I'd be too on the nose. Nah, Lisa Frank's the way to go. Yeah. It'll be all 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 colored up. You could also. Uh, we should have added the word cyberpunk as well. I think we'll get way, way there. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get we'll get most of the All way right. There. A All bear right, hungry licks off uh Lars licks sorry. <laughs> licks off <laughs> a man. Hey, lick me off, bear boo boo. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. I'm sorry. You look at him. All right, here we go. Scrolling. Oh. oh. Ah. <laughs> These are uh <laughs> These are very specific pornography images. <laughs> Um, it is Pride Month. I mean, these images are worth tens of thousands of dollars on the internet, um, including this one where a Tim and Eric style tongue is going from a bear to an open mouth YouTuber. Uh, I like the one where uh, the man, the man with a jar of honey for a hand, is hand in hand with the bear's with claw the bear. and its armpit. Wait, hold, can we go back to that prompt? <laughs> a, a bear, bear hungry, hungry licks, licks honey off, off a man's, man's arm, arm while eating, eating it in the style of Lisa, Lisa Frank. Frank. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> it's got the rainbow colors. The illus It's not perfect. <laughs> This was not perfect. I don't that think one, that this that is That one actually was the, the, the cover of, of the most popular zine in college. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to save that one. <laughs> save it. Okay. All right. All right. We only all right. have a few Good wishes left. Just a few more. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Should we try a name or is that if it's well, one of our no, names or is that no, too no, much? No, no, no. We don't want that. No names. I, I, okay. I, no names. I, 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 Good, again, Good to know. This is in beta. We're trying to play within the rules of the whitelisting, and that means uh, we want to stay in our lane. Um yeah, that's why all, right. all of my wishes involved Voltron and, Ult and Optimus Prime and Abraham Lincoln. How about this? A, 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 a Rembrandt-styled <laughs> canvas of podcasters jumping up and down on the moon while giving each other a high five. Okay. It, that's pretty good. Yeah. But just podcasters don't, don't do I got it. I got it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Podcasters jumping up and down on the moon while giving each other a high dash five and telling jokes to their chat room one word. Generate. Can you add that the, the, the chat room is like snarky and funnier than them? It'll do that automatically. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's always true. Always. Uh, but uh, yeah. two hours, two hours just vanished from my life into this. This shit is fucking magical. All right. A Rembrandt style canvas of podcasters jumping up and down on the moon while giving each other a high five and telling jokes Real to quick. their chat room. Before we see, you got predictions? Uh, Mustaches, yes or no? Yes. Yeah. Microphones. Yes. yes. Sure. Uh, Moon? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe, after maybe that a all. French girl. Maybe a French girl in there. How, how do you think they're going to rep represent the Are chat they going to be kissing? No. Last one they were doing more than kissing. <laughs> <laughs> and he was a hungry, hungry bear. Yeah. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. What do we right. got? We've got. Here. Oh! <laughs> oh my this God! Is amazing! This is my favorite children's book. Oh yeah. my God! Holy shit! <laughs> Holy shit is right. Um, although these two in the corner are a bit horrific. Um, wow! This looks that's amazing. Wait, scroll back up. This looks so good. I love this. Everyone, they have my a podcast. I actually, have mustache. The one. I got the mustache. This one looks like Brian. Okay. 
<laughs> Doesn't it? Also, by the way, they're on the moon, and then there's another moon. <laughs> a moon in the corner. Oh, another shit, he's here. That's moon. Mac tonight. It is. <laughs> it's a different guy. That's the title of I'm, I'm clicking uh, this one. That's a save. People baby. are ready to buy these on shirts. Yeah, save that one. Put that one in the Discord. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, one more wish. One more wish. One more we wish. Gotta call it. All right, here we go. Come on. Here we go. All right, come, come on. on. Come room. on. All right, so uh, 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 chat, chat, room, chat room, give us some shit. Uh, a uh, with, with a style. drinking on the moon. Van Gogh style, action, action comic, comic book, book style, style of Megazord stuck in rush hour LA traffic <laughs> in the 90s. <laughs> uh, space cowboy dances on dancer pole in the style of David Lynch. <laughs> I think they now let's go. Anime president deciding which law to pass before 5 p.m. <laughs> <laughs> Um, old, uh, John old John Smokey Sp- playing spoons with the possum posse for the Super Bowl halftime show. Actually, I'm video game that pixel one. art of a sad man sitting on a dock of the bay thinking about moon food. <laughs> no, 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 no. Pol Pot drinking ruin them, probably. No, no, no. Fake like, moon landing favorite, what, in 60 what, is, what, what is the funniest style we could think of of a man sitting on the dock of the bay <laughs> watching the tides roll away? Um... Uh, 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 Kandinsky. Okay. Kandin- uh, Kandinsky. No. H.R. Geiger. H.R. Geiger <laughs> of a goth sitting on the dock of the bay watching the tides roll away. Yeah. Okay. A goth sitting on the dock of the bay. Watching the, watching tides, the tides roll away. Roll in away. In the style of H.R. Geiger. In the style of H.R. Geiger. Okay, now I'm going to spy. Sure you want to do Jack Kirby? <sighs> sure you want to do R. Crumb? No. Uh, I mean, I'm I'm most curious about what it will come up with H.R. Geiger. Okay. All right. Generating now a goth sitting on the dock of the bay. Generating so now a goth sitting on the dock of the bay <laughs> in the style of H.R. Geiger. Did- a sentence I have never spoken in my entire <laughs> life yeah. until today. R slash original <laughs> sentences. <laughs> yes. I like that we were doing a dry run for when computers take all of our jobs. <laughs> all right. Here we go. A guy sitting on the dock of the bay watching the tides roll away in the style of H.R. Geiger. Getting some scrolling. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, oh, Jesus. Oh, so good. These are so fuck. These are my favorite World of Warcraft illustrations. Man. In another part of the planet, Chris Angel orgasmed without explanation. Oh, please don't listen directly into the micro. Oh. Oh, wow. Oh, these are cool. This is great concept art for uh, Obi-Wan. <laughs> I like this one. I'm saving this one. Yeah. Watching the tides roll in. Okay. All right. All right. All right. We got one the more. Bow house playing again. <laughs> we'll, play, we'll play. We'll play. One, we'll, uh, we'll do one more while we take us out. Uh, 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 real quick. Every uh, Somebody come up with something and then we'll figure out what we learned. Hmm. Uh, I, I really, I really liked anime president, uh, uh D- deciding, deciding which law to which sign law in to pass before 5 p.m. Uh, uh, panicking about what law to pass before 5 p.m. Okay. Anime president deciding what law to pass. Before yeah. But, 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 but make uh, let's panic. add a lot yeah. of words. Uh, okay. T- a terrified anime, uh, president, s- sweaty and muscular. <laughs> Okay. Deciding which law to pass before 5 p.m., comma, which is only seconds away. And then in the style in werewolf <laughs> of a werewolf. <laughs> no, 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 no. Uh, d- 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 just leave it as only seconds away because we already have anime, so we okay. don't want to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. An okay. anime okay. world. We don't want All that. Right. In the meantime, while that's generating bread, what did we learn today? We have learned that Justin oh, makes night. some very Pretty risky decisions. Night. We've learned Jesus. that Brett does not know how kids tell jokes. <laughs> <laughs> we know that the uh, the uh, the chat room is uh, very funny, very funny people, yep. and that Bryce does a great job of putting up with all of us. Huzzah! <laughs> Huzzah! All right, let's see it. A terrified anime president, sweaty and muscular, panicking about which law to pass before 5 p.m., which is only seconds away. Oh, oh 
Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that was Trump. <laughs> That's so coquettish. Oh, okay. <laughs> the robots won. The robots won. It's still a great night. <laughs> oh, Shine on, you, you crazy, crazy diamonds. We love you guys. Let's get drunk and laugh tonight There's never been a greater, greater night Yay, yay! Diamond Club hopes you have enjoyed this program. <laughs> uh, <laughs>